My name is Eva Alexander and I am the Executive Director at Lighthouse Immigrant Advocates. I am here today to share my story. I was born in Mexico and came to the United States when I was 12. My family and I came here because we were victims of police brutality in our home country. My mother being a single mom, she knew that her kids would have a safe future here in the United States. Aside from that, I was a regular kid. I went to school, struggled with homework, was late for classes, and had many friends throughout the years. There was always a part of me that felt lonely. There was always a part of me that felt ashamed of being an immigrant, of being different. I was ashamed of having to explain to my friends what a quinceañera was. I was ashamed of always having to translate for my mom. And I was just lonely. But I knew I could do it. I knew I could go through it because my family was here, because my mom was here. She's always been a pillar of support for me and my family. In 2013, I married my husband. And in 2014, we began a spousal petition to adjust my status. In 2015, we welcomed our first son. And in January of 2016, when my son was four months old, my mom suddenly had to go back to Mexico. And it was tough. My son, who is now six years old, has only seen her two or three times. I now have a one-year-old who has never met her. We've had to go through birthdays, Christmases, pregnancies without her, without my pillar of support. To put things into perspective, Lighthouse Immigrant Advocates was founded in November of 2015. And I can't help to think, what if? What if my mom would have found Lighthouse Immigrant Advocates when she needed them? What if there would have been a resource in her community that could help with her legal needs in her language, someone she would have trusted that didn't cost thousands of thousands of dollars. I am here today to share my story, one that I don't ever really share because part of me is still a little bit of ashamed and scared and lonely. I am here today because I want other immigrant families and refugees to know that you are not alone. That there are people in this community who have gone through similar situations and who are going through those situations right now. I support the work that we do at Lighthouse Immigrant Advocates because I don't want to see another family separated.